On this video, we are going to learn how to use a MIDI controller with THU desktop version. We made a similar video for THU iOS that you can check out following the link in the video description here below. Performing live using THU on your laptop is a great sounding and convenient solution for any guitar player. So we need to understand how to move among our presets and banks and also control all the functions we want in real time. We are using a pretty standard MIDI foot controller and all the settings will be done inside THU. So let's open the MIDI window from the upper menu. The most basic use we can do to MIDI control THU is to select the different presets inside the selected bank. This function is easily selectable by flagging the tab Program Changes Recall Presets in Current Bank. This way we can move on our pedal board selecting the preset numbers we need to recall, moving through the device banks to use all the 128 presets we can memorize in a single bank on THU. Of course we can customize our MIDI mapping to better serve our needs so we can assign any function to a specific control change number on our MIDI controller. In this case, we need to unflag the preset selection option we saw before. Considering the huge number of functions, THU MIDI mapping is based on the learn concept. So let's say we want to assign the first four buttons on our pedal board, respectively to previous bank, next bank, previous preset and the next preset functions. What we need to do is just go on the function we want to control, press learn, then press twice the pedal we want to assign to it, then press OK. Scrolling down we can find all the functions we can MIDI control remotely, so we can also decide to assign an expression pedal not only to the classic volume level, but to any variable parameter inside our effects. All these control change settings are global, so they work the same on any bank and preset inside THU. This scenario has a specific protocol, so for example, if you assigned a control change to an overdrive function, but you have two overdrive models in the same preset, the control change will work on the first one in the signal chain by default. Same if you use the splitter component to use two amps simultaneously, so all the control changes you programmed for the amp will work on the upper amp in the signal chain. We can decide to customize our MIDI mapping on a single preset, so we can assign a control change not simply to an effect category, but to a specific model. Doing that is pretty simple. We just need to right-click on the effect parameter we need to assign, then select the Learn MIDI for Current Preset option, then proceed as we did for the Global Control Change programming. If your MIDI controller allows you to move from Program Change mode to Control Change 1, you can easily move through your bank presets, then use all the programmed control changes on each of them, with no needs to operate on THU MIDI mapping window. As you can see, it's very simple to program all the MIDI functions we want to use to enjoy the THU power in a live situation.